I think going to grad school for film is great if you want to teach, even though you don't actually have to go to grad school if you want to teach, but that's sort of like the direct way to become professor so-and-so is to get an MFA in something or other. Um, I totally feel you. I too am an immigrant, child of, and you know, everyone's like, so PhD? <laughs> you know, <laughs> and you're like, that's not what I do. That this is a practical, it's a practical field. And so having a degree in something, it, it's not medicine. It's not, it, it doesn't actually, what I need to do is actually have practical experience. I think that's what you need. I think that's what would be more useful for you if you want to perform animation, I mean like create animation as opposed to teaching animation. Um, <coughs> Not to say that there's terrible things that will happen in a grad school. I think grad school can be great in terms of networking, in terms of being able to also have a place to practice and create things a and have a soft landing when it sucks, because it will, because that's how life is, <laughs> you know, like your first, and being able to do it at a slightly lower cost than what it would take to have things come out of your pocket. Um, so, you know, those are all wonderful and important things about being in school and sort of using that path. Um, but it, but you're still going to have to come back and do the networking and get the practical experience anyways. So it's not like that's going to be the fast track for you and then you're just going to get an amazing job immediately. Um, I mean, you could, but that's usually not the way that goes.